So for this couple, clearly something went tragically wrong on that October night. And for the detectives who began to investigate, their attention turned to James Ray, having left behind his daughter with his brother, Robert Ray, and those two suitcases. There were two suitcases that he packed for his daughter with a lot of clothing. He printed out and left for his brother a Disney cruise itinerary. There were certified checks. One was in the amount of $11,500 for his daughter. The other was in the amount just shy of $10,000 for Robert Ray to cash for the daughter. He also left a letter for his brother this letter that Ray left for his brother is chock full of information for investigators. But first and foremost, it's a startling admission that Ray did in fact shoot his girlfriend, Angela. He says he has an explanation, but he also goes on to say, quote, I am scared and don't want the long burden of a trial to prove my point. In the aftermath of the shooting, he felt he was in a no-win situation, so he had to flee. And he also didn't have his ducks in a row. He knew he was going to be arrested and that he would need bail money. So he had to figure that out before he turned himself in. On the news, it was saying that James Ray was on the run for killing Angela. Investigators are now looking for Bledsoe's boyfriend, 55-year-old James R. Ray III. We didn't know where he was. It was very dramatic. He is in the wind, as we like to say. Uh, which is, you know, we don't know his whereabouts, and all we can do is gather enough information. It is quite a story, and there's more. In the letter, Ray drops several bombshells, including claims that Angela was becoming violent with him. After nine years of this long relationship, Angela was done. She was leaving James Ray. She wanted out, period. Some are even wondering if the relationship was doomed from the start when Angela discovered an explosive secret he'd been keeping from her. <laughs>